there! We've been talking a lot about arthritis and, eliminate, and inflammation. And today we're going to talk about how an elimination diet can help remove the food triggers that can aggravate your arthritis. Some forms of arthritis are related to an overactive immune system. Well, food sensitivities can trigger your immune system to overreact. And an elimination diet helps identify and remove these food triggers, which means your immune reaction, which causes inflammation, may decrease. So fortunately, when clients are on a full healing program with me, elimination diets aren't necessary forever. Don't get me wrong, there's some foods that we should just avoid altogether forever. <laughs> I'm not referring to those foods, but I am talking about foods that are nutrient dense and we want to be able to eat them. So how do you start on an elimination diet? Well, it's different for everyone and our testing can direct us to the best place to start for each individual person. So once we know that, then we'll stop, we'll have you stop eating these foods for a specific period of time, and then we'll reintroduce each food one by one. And then if you have any sensitivity or reaction, then we're gonna ask you to avoid that food for a little while longer. And of course, some foods are easier to avoid than others, so that will be factored in but we can help you find the right replacements and the natural ingredients so that you can enjoy your meals while reducing the risk of an overactive immune response. So if you're struggling with arthritis, we can help you determine if an elimination diet is right for you. If an overreactive immune system is contributing to your arthritis, there are many naturopathic and lifestyle factors that can help. Give us a call, send us an email, message us here, and we'll get started together. See you next time.